Hey everyone, Hat Stack Mike here, and I want to show you what's in my pocket. This is the Funky S, and it has become my new keychain. The Funky S is amazing at what it accomplishes in such a small package. It's a teeny tiny little emulation device that's meant to be used as a keychain, so you can have it wherever you go. You can check it out for yourself at funkey-project.com. It comes in three different colors, but I personally had to go with the retro gaming gray, because I'm old school like that. It also comes with different button colors that you can swap out. So I put all of the green ones in mine, because I love the color green. I've had mine for a few months now, and it has been so great to have. It can play NES, Genesis, Game Boy Advance, and even PS1 games perfectly. I had to make sure to put on the essentials like Bubsy 3D, Shaq Fu, and Home Improvement. Okay, now I'll show off some real games here. Yeah, the screen is incredibly small, but it works. Playing platformer games like Mario and Sonic or fighting games like Street Fighter and Mortal Kombat. It's all great doing it on this little thing. The Genesis emulator also runs Sega CD and 32X games, which is pretty awesome. Even 3D games play pretty well on the Funky S. Here's one of my personal favorites, Jumping Flash. It's maybe a little disorienting, sure, but I still love playing this game on this thing. It's just so incredibly cool to be able to whip out Tony Hawk's Pro Skater at any point. You may notice that I don't have much in the way of RPGs on here, and... Yeah, I wouldn't recommend trying to play something where you're gonna have to read a whole lot of text. That's one thing where I feel like this super tiny screen is maybe at a disadvantage. If you want to try and play RPGs on a funky S of your own though, then hey, Go for it. You do you. Beyond emulation, the community has been doing an awesome job of porting stuff over to the Funky S. While there may be no Nintendo 64 emulation, I can still run Super Mario 64 on this thing. It may feel a bit weird to control without an analog stick, but... It's Mario 64 on a keychain! How cool is that? And for the hardcore Sonic fans like myself who follow Sonic fan games, the excellent Sonic Robo Blast 2 has been ported over to the Funky S as well. I mean, just 
To have all of this stuff on my keychain wherever I go is awesome beyond belief. Well, that about wraps up my video on the Funky S. I love this thing. And just to make it clear, I was not paid or endorsed in any way. I just read about this online and was curious and wanted to check it out for myself and fell in love with it. So I wanted to make a whole video talking about it. Well, I'll catch you guys later and have a hat stack and good day.